It's the kind of beat to go. Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Joey, and this is going to be Let's Play Episode 4 in our Beginner's Let's Play series. If I just repeated that, I'm sorry guys, but um, really exciting stuff today. This has been the global launch for World's Domination. It's probably one of the most exciting days in a very long time, guys. It's been one heck of a ride for this beta, but now it's out for everyone. All of you guys have the game. Now we've got tons of new subscribers trickling in, and guys, we've hit 300 subscribers, so... This is kind of a little mashup video. First off, I want to thank you guys so much for 300 subscribers, guys. I'm going to be making this, uh, every time we hit a landmark, I'm going to thank you guys. Uh, maybe I'll be doing some sort of special video down the line, but right now we're, it's pretty exciting right now. I'm more too heated right now. I'm kind of overwhelmed by all the stuff that's going on right now, but first off, I just want to thank you guys. Secondly, guys, World Domination hit the editor, got the editor's choice, guys. <laughs> eh, I'm just so excited. I'm getting stumbled here, but guys, this is probably really exciting. Guys, look at this. I mean, we made the front page of the App Store. It's ex it's so exciting. It's insane. So let's go ahead and hit up the game because that's what you're here for to go play World Domination. So here we are, and I believe we're going to be hitting up. Where are we going next? Where's our next destination on this map? I'm not sure. All right. So we are on New Orleans now. Before we get into New Orleans, I want to make a really important kind of tip. We're going against some Titans on this map, and Titans are pretty much going to power through anything unless you have a sniper. So I'm going to recommend getting your sniper at least up to level four at this point. Just so that you'll be able to kind of handle those titans and not have them cause any problems for you guys and just make them the best they can be. So let's get those snipers up to level four, guys. And that's pretty much my main key thing for you guys for this level. So I went ahead and did the first one, just kind of give a good look at it and see what we're going to need for this, right? And the sniper is the way to go. So let's go ahead and fight. We're going to get an uncommon pack when we do complete this. Let me go ahead and update my team to the squad I want. Let's go ahead and swap out those guys and bring in my top team here. See if it's pretty fleshed out the way I want it. Hmm. It's got a gunfighter in there. And I'm going to throw in let's throw in a medic. We need a paramedic. We also have the cop here, which is the stream team unit, which I actually have. Had it on both my accounts. Pretty exciting. I'm glad to have the cop here, too. The trooper. Got a new name. Got the trooper. Let's actually swap out that and put in the trooper. And <coughs> we got a level four scatter shot from Mahitsa. That's how you spell it. I don't even know, guys. But also, we got the new guild. We got some new players trickling in here. And we're going to try to hit some top tier guild raids here soon. But we'll see as time progresses. So, as you can see, the Titans are right here. Now, this is a very interesting little layout. I'm going to actually let them get past that wall and focus all of my guys and have them kind of trickling right here. I'm not going to be too worried. I'm going to let them get through that wall, break through it, no problem. And I'm just going to have my guys kind of chilling back here where they have plenty of room to kind of do what they need to and just dominate the floor here. So, I did do a a bit of upgrading here guys i as you can see I upgraded some people okay let's go ahead and throw these guys over here go through my firefighter my paramedic and we're gonna have a lot of melee units on this pad but as you can see guys i've been doing a little upgrading i got my fire chief up to level four sniper up to level four as are recommended just kind of take out those uh titans so as you can see we're about to get a titan here and as you can see easily picked off that way it's not gonna be a problem at all for you guys i don't want you guys worrying about it at all it just makes it easier. Plus, it'll take out those mutated zombies that much easier. Let's go ahead and check it out. Titans are hoarders. They take any scrap and make it into armor, allowing them to ignore some damage. Armor allows him to ignore low damage units. Your low damage units will deal no damage. So that's why I'm recommending get that sniper up to level 4 at this point. Use high damage units to pierce his armor. That's what the sniper's for, guys. Let me go ahead and send these units here. Get some people going. We got plenty of time. That pad is not doing anything. Very uneventful over there. Looks like these guys are just about to break through this wall. And it is about to get a whole lot more interesting. So I'm going to go ahead and stack these pads a little bit more. With some close range gunfighters and mercenaries and whatnot. And with that, we got tons of extra time to pretty much set all these guys up for success. And just deck them out with a whole lot of defense. So these guys are... I'm going to go ahead and let them go ahead and start. I'm going to throw an extra sniper over there to take out those titans. Stim them up. Let's flare them back a little bit just to give our guys a little bit of extra time. Let that titan get taken out by the sniper there. And we are good to go. Let's get them taken out real quick. Looks like that... Mm, let's get that titan, guys, guys. Come on. Come on. All right. So we got some extra people to throw down here. I'm going to go ahead and throw down... So down a medic to kind of heal up and then a cop. And we're just going to work on taking out my people over here. I'm going to go and stim them up, give them some extra juice, and we start taking out these people. They're just about to break through this wall, and I'm not liking that one bit. Come on, guys. Let's take those guys out for me. Oy vey. They got in, guys. Okay, so 
problem here is I was hoping those walls would just kind of dominate for me. Now, it looks like we're holding down the fort fairly well. I'm going to go ahead and flare them away, stem up my group, throw a sniper back here. Let's go ahead and throw, if we need it, I'm going to throw down my firefighter. But it looks like we're handling it pretty well. We ended up kind of holding those guys off just fine. So no worries there, guys. We ended up passing it. And it's pretty simple. Really, if you can get a very good amount of kind of gunner guys and you can get a sniper in there, you'll be set. Let's go and show our rewards. So what are we going to win, boys? We got some cans, a firefighter, and some more cans. Can't complain with that, guys. So let's go ahead and head on to the next level three here. Completed. Let's fight. <coughs> mm, excuse me. Got a bit of a cold here, guys. On to the next level. Pretty exciting stuff. So I'm going to be trying to pump out a... Still going to have to stay daily, guys. Only one for today, I think. Uh, depending, it may be a surprise if there's two, but I'm not expecting two. And I'm going to actually have to put out some extras over the weekend. I'm going to be putting out a lot over the weekend if I can, just to kind of catch up and get a lot of views for all you new players out there. So I'm going to go ahead and start putting some people out here. I'm going to do something very simple, similar this time as well. Let's throw a sniper. Captain Zeta is going to go over here this time along with the Merc and level four, level two, Medic, Cap, and let's go ahead and start those waves. Move these guys kind of into position here, move them back there, and people are free. We are go for launch. I'm going to speed this one up just a little bit, guys, get these waves are rolling. I'm going to go ahead and send these early. I'm feeling lucky here, guys. I want to get the best time bonus I possibly can. I'm going to stem these guys up. These guys are about to break through here. This just got a heck of a lot more interesting, guys. Let me go ahead and start stacking these guys. Oh, my Lord. Okay, so just in case we do run into some problems, I'm going to go ahead and throw down that firefighter, throw in those guys, flare them away, give us some time to do something, and kind of send those guys out. And I'm going to throw another medic there. Now, it's going pretty fast, guys. This game can get really rapid pace, but you got to decide where you want to put your units and nowhere. So I threw a sniper back there just to have some extra snipers just because we want to have as many mutated units being taken out before we can just have a chance to take them out so those snipers are able to take out a lot of those guys pretty quickly we get that medic keeping everybody on our front line very healthy and now we just have to deal with a couple drones and some spitters looks like they're all gone now it's just a couple drones to deal with i'm gonna go ahead and move my rally point up a little bit let's get those guys taken out a little bit quicker i'm gonna throw in a merc over there to help kind of thin out the horde a little bit quicker and guys it looks like we are going to be set for this map we got a win guys and that's all it takes really pretty much for this map, the key is getting your snipers in a safe location as far back as possible, getting your melee units where there's no walls, very well situated with a medic of some sort, and just things like that. That's really what's going to kind of be the key to success here. So let's go ahead and continue here. Got another medic and some rations. I love it. So it looks like we're going to have two more rounds here. I'm going to have to use some coins, I believe, to heal up my guys. I don't recommend using coins, guys, but for me, just for you guys, I'm just kind of using coins to quickly regenerate my team. So you guys can get the best experience possible. Looks like we're going to be able to get another attack. Let's go. <laughs> all right, guys. So we got one more attack left, I think. And I'm going to have to possibly coin the next one. Okay, we got all the same maps here. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Um, All right. So Captain Zeta is going over here since she's more of a gunner, you could say. But when he gets to close range, she can become a little bit of a little puncher. Throw some punches. But I'm actually going to throw my snipers back here this time. They're completely out of the loop. And this way they get a better shot and plus my guys get at least more room for more gunners up front. So I'm going to go ahead and throw. So there's level five Merc in here. I love that. Meg's going to go over here with my melee units. And I'm going to throw in a Merc over there. And that should handle that area pretty much until I'm going to kind of reinforce it a little bit later. Let's throw in a cap or a trooper over there. And let's get these guys rolling. So let's go ahead and start the waves. Send that wave ahead. Speed it up just a little bit for the beginning to get things going and we got that Titan taken care of Let me go ahead and send this runner group right here and slow things down a little bit I'm gonna send a bunch of groups here. I'm sending all these waves get them going Because I'm feeling lucky guys. I'm feeling lucky So I'm going to go ahead and move these guys up just a little bit moving back just a tad Just in case they get a little bit too close for comfort I'm gonna start reinforcing these guys with more gunners So you guys as they become available you definitely throw them down in this walled area because that will allow for Oh my gosh, we're low, we're low, running low on uh, storage, guys. That's not fun. All right, guys. So, like I said, throw as many gunners in there as possible because that's going to kind of leave you the best success. So, we are taking down people, people, one by one. So, Titan's being dropped. Throw another sniper back here. Like I said, the snipers, 
perfectly situated back there with plenty of like juice and whatnot. I'm gonna go ahead and use my flare to kind of give me just a couple seconds to kind of recoup over here. Now we gotta hopefully take out these guys a little bit quicker on this side over here. I'm gonna go ahead and throw down a level five Merc to go help, help take out all of those guys for me. And it looks like we just got a couple drones left. I'm gonna speed this up, last bit up just a little bit because we just got a couple drones left and they are going down. Down they go, 338 trophies plus our time bonus, which will put us at, I don't even know, 355 plus 17 out of 11. All right, guys, so I'm gonna go pause this video for like five seconds. It's gonna seem like I never leave him left, but I'm gonna go ahead and clear up some space on my device and I'll be right back with that final level, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Be right back. All right, guys, so I actually completed this by accident because I forgot to click record. Don't even know what happened, but I'm gonna go ahead and go through that last round just really quick. Make sure to rate this app if you haven't already. I have already done it, so no worries there. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish off, oh yeah. Uh, accidentally did that forgot to click record but we're gonna go ahead and fight let me go ahead and update my team real quick uh, my guys ended up kind of getting a little tired we do have a handyman now we unlocked that do i have any extra paramedics okay so i'm gonna throw in that medic there we got a level five what's that guy's name i never use i'm not the biggest user of medics but as of this new global launch build you could say world's domination i've become really accustomed to using them i think they're really important so here we go new orleans it's time to get on away, guys. This is going to be our last level, I believe, if I clicked on the right one. What are we going to get? Did I click on the wrong one? I don't even know. <coughs> I'm sorry, guys, if I did. You know, this could be just a brain fart, and I probably did click on the right one, but I'm just going to redo this just in case. So, where are we going? Come on. We're just going to replay the last level. I'm not sure if this is going to give us the right one. I brain farted, but guys, really the same thing nothing too different like i said really the key here is to get use out of those outlaws and snipers those high powered guys who are able to really okay so we're not going to be able to get this last round guys but moral of the story guys it was very similar to we had an interesting little pattern here now i would recommend getting your snipers in a good solid location in the middle there get a lot of support from your gunfighters as time kind of builds up throw in those uh close range melee units things like that if you have a medic definitely bring that along and try to give yourself as much time to let those units re or uncool down and give them just plenty of time to just do work guys but thank you so much for watching i really do hope you enjoyed uh yeah it's about all it's about all i got guys but thank you so much for watching we are going to see you guys in the next episode if i actually looks like we got a pack to open let's go and open that pack really quick and then it's gonna time to say goodbye so let's go ahead and tap that get it going what do we got hello hello what do we got so we got a merc and a firefighter what do we got in the epic pack guys we have contractor sweet i'll take it i'm gonna start working on that too scatter shot my favorite unit by far yes hopefully a desperate i wouldn't even get those emt sweet okay these are actually really good units i'm happy with these all right good pack good pack <laughs> all right guys but thank you so much for watching again um hope you guys look forward to the next episode in our beginners let's play uh yeah as always hope you guys enjoyed guys uh thank you so much for watching i'll see you guys in the next video see you guys